and welcome to Buzz Plays. Now, people that subscribe to my channel and watch uh, my uh, little series of vaults will know that this isn't the same view as I usually have. This is because, sadly, when I tried to update my vault so that I could uh, update my power armor, um, it seemed to bug out and kind of deleted my world. Um, I've tried to get it back and it just kept crashing. Um, so basically I've started up a new uh, new world, um, I've built my house as you guys can see here, um, I'll take you on a quick tour around, um, basically I've uh, got all the same stuff as I had before, um, I've just made it a little bit better and a bit easier to get around. Um, so let me take you on a quick tour, um, first off if, we, if you see here we've still got our two solar panels, I did make another one which I've put over here. As you can see, we go over our little bridge and we've got our two launch pads. Um, they're all connected up and ready to go. We just need to put the missiles in. Um, and they've got a inaccuracy of uh, zero blocks because we put the support frames back in. And I've, like I said, I've added this extra um, solar panel to help power these ones over here so that I don't have to try and drag the cables across. Um, I think it's quite cool because I've put them on a separate little island as well, which we've connected with a bridge. If we just head on inside, um, as you guys can see here as well, uh, all the machines are all connected via the advanced battery box. Um, we've got the coal generator here as well, um, adding a little bit of extra power. And we've got the crusher, the enrichment chamber, uh, metallurgic infuser and the basic smelting factory. Um, I haven't bothered putting in the um, electric furnace simply because we've got the basic smelter and I didn't see the point. Um, and also for some reason that when I updated my um, Sfax Pure BD Craft, uh, even though the transformers have got the coloured texture in uh, on the Not Enough Items mod, um, sadly, when you put it down, it goes white for some reason. Um, so, I have to have a look at that at a later date. Um, we've got the bio generator here as well, and we've got a battery box which has got of uh, 1.5 megajoules in there um, for a bit of backup power as well. Um, I've also put the tinker table downstairs now, um, and I've uh, upgraded the power tool, but only to have the shovel, the pickaxe, pickaxe and the axe. I haven't put anything else on it else, uh, anything else on it either, apart from um, the ba a battery as well. Um, but we will, I will be looking at putting the plasma cannon and uh, melee assist on there as well. Um, but we need to get a few extra materials for that. Uh, if we go upstairs on the roof, I sh uh, I've put the um, radar. I've um, got some new uh, some new um, GUI on that, which is quite nice. Um, and yeah, basically it took me a while to get this area all flattened out um, so that we've got a nice area. Um, I've put the launch pads over on the extra island so that we've got a few places that we can shoot the missiles off to. Um, also, I haven't made a blast proof bunker to test the explosives because for some reason blast craft's been taken out on the latest uh, update of vaults. Um, apparently it wasn't stable or something so they've taken that out. So I haven't been able to create an extra chamber for that, but I will be testing explosives, so I'll probably make a different area. Um, but for this episode, I thought I'd show you guys how to create a, um, not a well gun, but a, where is it? A turret gun, a gun turret. Um, and basically, I just thought it'd be a good thing to have on top of the roof um, for if people came down to try to attack me. So I'm going to build a, I'll probably try and build two turret guns, so what we need is a turret gun and a turret platform. So for the actual turret gun itself we only need a basic circuit and some steel ingots, so that's pretty easy to make. Um, and for the turret platform we're going to need piston, two chests, a basic circuit, a battery and four steel plates. So let's get on with this. Um, basically also what I've done is obviously I've lost all my materials, so I have uh, Replace, I've gone back and watched a couple of my other videos just to try and figure out what it is I had. Um, so I basically spawned in a few of the bits that I had. When I was killing a skeleton, I actually had I managed to pick up this uh, Osium 
sword, I think that's how you pronounce it. But um, I'll keep with my steel sword for now. Um, so yeah. Uh, so let's go and find the bits we need. So here we go. We're gonna need some steel. So let's take the steel with us. Um, and then we're gonna need the stuff for the circuit. So we're gonna need redstone, bronze, and some wires. So let's grab the bronze, the redstone, and what else was it? Bronze, redstone, and wires. The wires, I think I'll put this one. Yep. So there's all that. So let's uh, create our two circuits we're going to need for the two uh, turret guns. So there's our two steel plates. Steel plates go in the middle two redstones and then two wires there we go so there's our two basic circuits and then if we put the basic circuits i believe it was there yep and then put two steel on along the top and also on the center square that gives us our two turret guns so now we've got the two turret guns we're going to need to build a turret platform now we need two turret platforms for this, so we're going to need two pistons, uh, another basic, uh, two basic circuits, another two basic circuits, um, a battery, uh, some chests and stuff. So let's start off with the two pistons first. It's pretty easy to make: uh, iron ingot and a redstone. So let's grab our wood. Um, we need some iron ingots, which are over here. There we go. So um, I believe it's wood along the top, uh, iron ingots is it down the side, uh, can't actually remember, oh no it's cobblestone down the sides, iron ingot in the middle, so let's grab some cobblestone which is in this chest, uh, so cobblestone, uh, iron ingot, redstone and wood and we're going to need two of these actually so let's double up on all of this so there's our two pistons uh, we're also going to need uh, four chests so this is going to use up quite a lot of our wood and I'll have to go and get some more now that I've got everything set up I'll uh, get everything genuinely now um, I'll go and find a mine as well to set that up somewhere um, so yeah, we've got the four chests, we've got the pistons, we're going to need, what else was it, uh, steel plates and a battery, so let's grab some uh, tin, so there's our tin, uh, to make the two batteries, it's pretty easy, I've made these plenty of times, it's just tin in kind of like the trouser shape, uh, with two um, redstones, and a coal. So we're actually going to need a coal. Let's pick all that back up. Uh, where did I put coal? Coal is in here as well. So let's do this again. Two batteries, which we don't need to charge up. Uh, it was still plates, so we need. Eight steel plates. So there's our eight steel plates. Um, and then we need another two basic circuits. So again, pretty easy to make these. Um, let's grab two bronze plates. So two bronze plates, two redstones in a diamond, and then two cables around the outside and that should be enough to create our turret platform so let's put all this together so it goes uh, base circuit in the center um, batteries on the bottom so I'm going to have to do these separately still plates in each corner uh, two chests either side and then our two pistons on the top so there's one turret platform and there's the other turret platform so we've got our two turret platforms and we've got our uh, turret gun so let's just chuck the rest of this stuff back in the chest for now so that 
doesn't get destroyed if I go upstairs and I get attacked by creepers or anything. Now I'm going to put them on each corner. So we're going to have to try and connect them up with the cables. Um, so what I'll do is I'll quickly make some extra cables because we've only got five. So we're going to need some more anyway. Um, so uh, one thing I haven't got is leather. So I will have to leave that for now and I'll have to try and plug it into the battery box here. Hopefully. So I'll have to go and get some leather or some wool. Now, I have seen plenty of sheep around, so um and basically all we need to do for these is if we put the turret say here is put one uh turret stand here and one turret stand here and at the moment you can't do anything with them. But if we add the turret gun on top on both of these you can see it's got the turret gun there and if, now if we click on it you get the cool uh, GUI uh, we need to make some ammunitions we can get some upgrades on there as well um, I'm not sure what actually these bits do but yeah there we go so yeah I'm not sure what they do but okay um, so we're gonna need to connect this in and then hopefully these will probably start to take out zombies and uh, creepers and stuff like that so if we go downstairs um, I will see if I can oh man which one's it in? is it that one it is that one right so let's replace that let's see if I've got enough cables because if not then I'll have to uh... I ain't gonna have enough cable I don't think I've got two left and I need to get up there um... Okay, well, I'll have to show you guys that next time. But what I'll do to just to finish this uh, episode off is I will create some of the ammunition that we need. So if we have a look for, I believe it's bullets. So if we just create these ones for now, this should be fine. So we need gunpowder, iron ingots, and we need bullet shells. And to make bullet shells, just, just tin ingots. So let's grab our tin ingots again. Um, and let's make a couple of these um, let's go and grab uh, have we got any gunpowder uh, I haven't got any gunpowder at the moment but I can make some quickly so gunpowder is uh, yeah, pretty easy sulfur so let's grab that sulfur and uh, the coal so, I don't want too many anyway. Uh, let's grab one more from this stack of sulfur. There we go. So, six in there, put the iron ingots on the top, and then the bullet casings go around the outside of there. So how many can we actually make of these? That's going to be it. So we can make quite a few. We've got 64. So if we go back up the stairs, we can split the 64 into the two turrets themselves. So uh, put 32 in there. And 32 in there. So what I'll do is I will create, uh, connect these up um, for my next episode, I think, um, because there's I haven't got any wool or anything to create the cables I'm going to need. Sadly, um, I can't move that battery box any closer. Um, yeah, sadly. All right. Well, what I'll do is I'll leave this episode here. Uh, I will go off when it gets light outside and go and try and find some uh, sheep or some uh, cows and get some leather and some wool up together so I can make some more uh, copper cables. Um, we'll connect this up at the start of the next episode. And uh, yeah, then you guys can see what it does, uh, what they do, should I say. Um, and um, 
I'll probably look at going to the Never in my next episode, so I can get some glowstone, so that I can add some uh, night vision to my helm um, for my power armor. Um, so if you're interested in that, please uh, subscribe and uh, look out for that episode. It should be out on Thursday, I believe. Um, if as long as I have no plans come up, as I release my videos on a Tuesday and a Thursday. So yeah, as I said, please subscribe, uh, please leave a comment if there's anything you'd like to see, and I will see you all next time.